Three years ago, I bought a little yellow Ford Transit Connect and started attempting to convert it into a camper van. I had no idea what I was doing, and it took a lot longer than I thought. Let me show you. Incredibly yellow. I kind of love it. So I've never done this before. Yeah, this is what we're working with. We started by gutting the inside. I think it used to be a council van, dog van, I don't really know. But it had this weird uh, resin, like all these different compartments that were sealed off. So we started by taking all of that out and then stripping it down to just the bare bones. From there, we added some noise insulation and some foam. Uh, in the walls and on the floors. We put in some flooring and then we started building the bed. Once we built the bed, we lay all the electrics and connected all of that to the battery, which was then connected to the car battery that charges as you drive. We finished the bed by cutting these slats out of hardwood that then pulls out into a bed. I thought it would take two weeks, it took about two years. Fast forward to today, let's go on a little trip to the Peak District and I'll give you a little tour of uh, our unfinished van. Our van. Cozy. cozy. It's nice and cozy. It's not much of a tour because um, <laughs> you can see it all in one can, shot. <laughs> you can just see it immediately. There's a view from the other side. So as you can see, there's the bench, and then it pulls out like that, and then you just sleep with your feet down that way. This is the bed underneath. Little slats that we've cut. It's got lights. Oh, oh there we go. Some carpet lining and also all on the door. So we've got these curtains, which are very, very budget. They do the job. Our bedding is all in the bag there, in the Ikea bag. Built with these like two by fours. We just made a frame. In there is a battery. Charges when we drive. You can see everything is kind of just thrown together um, just to get it livable. Maybe picked it white in the top and then kind of varnish the sides. We'll see. So I need to put a side table it's on here. Sheet. It's shabby It's shabby It's just not, it's not finished yet. <laughs> but we'll, we'll finish it one day. But for now, we love it. With the lights, it just kind of makes it as well. well there we go. That's our van. Where should we go? We just go find somewhere cool. Love Should we make some coffee? This is the best part about our van is parking up somewhere like that. Balance. Making coffee, yeah, <laughs> precariously balanced on our unfinished side table, which we'll finish soon, promise. So we've got a jet boil, an aeropress, and some decaf coffee, because it's, it's the afternoon. <laughs> 5 p.m. Coffee time. It's us making coffee in the van. We go on a walk and we make a coffee. Why did we get a van? We took a van trip to Iceland, around Iceland, and then Leaving that, we were like... Let's do our own. We want our own van. And then we bought this guy in 2021. And then I thought I would finish it in like two weeks. And it, it took about two years. <laughs> but now it's good enough for little trips. We could probably do a week in it. Yeah, we want to go to Europe, don't we? Yeah. And yeah, I'm in Ireland. Thanks for watching my vlog. <laughs> Okay, I won't call it a vlog then. No, it's funny. Remember to like. How about you just say bye? Oh, okay. Should we go? Yeah. <laughs>